What's up, everybody? Uh, another video coming to the channel. Um, as always, like and subscribe for more awesome baseball content. Um, I can't wait to drop this one. This one's going to be fun. So today we're looking at the top 10 hitters in baseball currently right now. And when I watched all their swings and started to put all of them together, I noticed a couple things. All of them within their own body movements are rear leg swingers, right? They all are launching their swings from their rear leg. They're all turning the barrel nice and deep. They're not pushing their hands. And, and we think that this is a coincidence, but anytime the MLB drops the top 10 hitters, I always go back and look. So let's slide into what is over here. So we watch Mookie Betts, watch the tilt, watch the move behind, right? Obviously he has his own way of doing things, right? He has his own unique body movements, but he is launching his barrel deep behind. Look at that connected turn. That's really nice. Now let's move on to Soto. Same thing. He's back to his old launch, right? Before he was kind of pushy last year, he's back to his launching from the rear leg, nice and deep behind him. Okay. Boom. Homer trout. We know trout's doing it. We know Trout's getting behind the baseball. We know he's launching from behind. He gets his foot down a little early, right? He kind of lands there first, but he's still launching nice and deep behind. Keep it going. What do you think the, now we got Otani. He's for sure behind the ball. Look at this move. Look at the barrel speed. Okay. Bobby Witt, barrel speed behind. Nice tilt. Very nice. Look at the barrel in the zone. Altuve, some might say he's a scissor guy. He is a scissor guy, but he's still tilting and launching from the rear leg. Look at the barrel. Look at it get on plane. The barrel's picking up speed back here. Okay, dinger. Alvarez, he falls a little bit more forward, but you can still see the tilt and the turn, right? That short connected barrel. Ozuna is tapped into the top 10. Look at his. He is super rear leg in his launch. Very tilt, very barrel behind. Really awesome look at this barrel in this position. And a couple more. Tatis, it's my guy. I'm a San Diego guy. It looks like he falls a little bit forward here on this one specifically. Still launching the barrel nice and deep. He's not pushing his hands. And last but not least, we have William Contreras, which I didn't expect to see him in there. And then I started looking at his swing, and he... There's a little bit more forward than the others, but still in a really good position. He doesn't leak any energy when that front leg lands. Still staying nice and short behind the baseball and absolutely pummels a few balls. So all I'm saying is when you look at the best of the best every single year, not just the kind of good, but the really, really, really good, they have their own unique body movements, their own unique style, but all of them, are rear leg launchers, rear leg movers, whether they know it or not. When you watch the mechanics, they're doing it under their own unique body movements. Okay, guys, it is a mechanical advantage that is going to give you the keys to being your best self. So if you want to know how that you can, you know, you can swing like these guys and actually learn to do this stuff, it's super simple. You just need the right coach. You need the right mentor. Go to the description box below. Click, click the link for a free lesson, a free, a free lesson with me remotely in my remote training your program. I will send it over to you. Um, you click the link, you sign up, you get in, and I will let you know if your swing is that of the, of the best players. And if it isn't, then how we're going to get it better. So click the link, check that, check it out. And I will see you inside the app. Don't forget to like, and subscribe. We'll see you in the next video.